really a dark year. Yeah. 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 We need somewhere to go for joy. Star Wars. <laughs> what are your what are your like feelings about that? I am thrilled. I mean, I um, I'm lucky enough to be friends with J.J. Abrams, thud, Dunk. and um, he actually asked me if I wanted to see the movie, and I thought he was just being nice, <laughs> and and I said no. My wife thinks I'm insane. She's like, why did you see the movie? He goes, oh, I thought he was just doing it because I'm a friend of his. And then he was like, no, no, I would really like to have seen the movie. I thought maybe you had an idea. So I feel, I feel like the biggest idiot in the world. Um, I love, I, I think uh, there's something so hopeful about reawakening the idea of the force. Because the force is the idea that it all, it binds us together. It doesn't divide us. And you know who the good guys are and you know who the bad guys are. And, and isn't that nice in a world where it's sometimes hard to tell? I mean, in some ways it feels like it's a great time for a movie like that. The same way after 9-11, it was a very good time to have the Lord of the Rings movies because there was clarity in our culture. Uh, there was a cultural artifact that, that had um, moral clarity.